Hey everybody, it's Modern Night One, and today we are going to pursue and capture the Brig Queen from the Enchanted City quest, which is sort of a quest that starts before the Tenochtitlan quest in search of the Jade Skull, and it goes after the Tenochtitlan quest is over. It's sort of the end of it. You trying to help this young lady find her sister, who is the captain of this ship. The reason why I'm following it around is to try to avoid all these stupid pirates that want to fight me, and they're going to get in the way of me getting the ship. Yeah, I'm going to have to see if I can run a couple of them off. I'm pretty sure they'll run. Well, that one guy looks like he's keen for a fight. Nice little frigate. I already have a couple of those in storage, though. I don't need them. Either. It's one of my new skins for the Arabella ship. How do you like her? She looks pretty awesome. Blub, blub, blub. What a shame. Alright, let's see if we can get that Brig Queen. Skipper, a vessel is approaching. It seems to be the Brig Queen. What will be your orders? Engage! Okay, so when I border, I want you guys to notice that the model is sort of messed up initially. Well, you'll notice it. it got the weather wind completely against us. Now, the reason why the model is going to look messed up is because their fighting animation is screwed up just for this encounter. Because I put her in an existing game instead of starting a new game. I can't reinitialize that specific quest file to take a new animation input. So we're just going to have to live with that funny uh, animation file just for this quest to finish it. And then she'll be normal. I'll take her onto some land and we'll go after some thugs and then you'll see that she fights just completely normal. In fact, I love the way she fights. If we can freaking catch her, do attack. Brig Queen is one of the fastest ships in the whole game. Once you do the Bermuda upgrades on her, she is unbelievably fast. Just 
definitely messing me up. See, what they don't realize is I'm here to actually help them, but they don't realize that. See, the whole crew is skeletons. They were cursed. And then, that's the whole purpose of the end of the quest, is to get, lift the curse and bring them back to normal. And then you can go back to uh, Miss Shepard and tell her that you've squared away her sister. Now, you know, one thing I've never done before, I've never gone back to see if there's a reunion or anything. So we'll do that in this video. We'll go back to see if there's a reunion of some kind. I got her now. She steered into irons. And I picked up the wind. Here we go. Boarding the Brig Queen. just started this game so the indexing goes slow when you first bring it up but all the rest of the corpses will loot fast. Also the recording software slows things down a little bit this uh, D3D your software. Don't want those. They are bad luck, although they're pretty valuable if you don't mind being unlucky for a little while. Alright, so remember her screwed up ammunition animation is only going to be temporary. I'll make you bleed. Hey lady, easy, easy, let's talk. Why are you jumping at me as a mad fury? We've nothing to talk about. You've attacked my brig. I had no choice. I had to get to the captain's cabin. Wait a minute. Is this your brig, you say? So he was under the impression that it was a guy. It has been for five years now. So you're the close and dear friend of Elizabeth. I thought she was talking about a man. Do you know my sister Elizabeth? Sure, it's on her request that I'm here now. And you are, I presume, her elder sister Daniel Shepard, aren't you? Exactly. Let me ask who you are. I'm called Captain Lawrence Prince. I've been looking for your brig to remove the curse. Tell me how it happened, how the curse of the Aztec God of the Dead affected you. So that's what it was. I still thought it was some scarecrow. It all happened at the Cape of Unfulfilled Hope in Maracaibo Bay near Des Moines. Now Des Moines, that's the... or Des Moines, that's the uh, enchanted city. That's where it all starts is when you go there and they attack you. You realize there's skeletons in the middle of the night and they try to keep you there. And you tell them, hey, I'll get away anyway. So then they ask you for your help. And you can either help them or not. If you don't help them, the quest stops. If you do help them, then you come to the end of it, and this is the end here. You probably know that I'm the daughter of Captain Staten, despite the fact that I'm a woman, I won the right to be captain of the Brig Queen. Once somewhere around Bermuda, I hired a captain named Pierre Cabal. It was my mistake. He's an utmost bastard. He captured some, some young Indian near Santa Catalina. Unfortunately, I learned about it only when we were entering Maracaibo. The bastard decided to sell the Indian and took the money. He said the Indian was his personal catch. Sure, I couldn't let this scandal happen. When we were in the middle of the bargain near Des Moines, I declared that it was either we shared the money or I'd let the Indian go. Finally, I had to let him go, but that bastard cabal took out a dag and shot the Indian in the back. A fight between us was inevitable, but never know what can happen. As soon as the Indian fell into the grass, moaning, some scarecrow jumped out of thin air, grabbed the dead Indian, and told us in a thundering voice we were all my crew, and I, that is, cursed, then it disappeared. 
Yeah, that was Mickey Blah Blah and the Quest in the flesh. So that's the Aztec God of the Dead that you end up fighting to get the skull, the Jade Skull. We were all struck dumb. Nobody thought of fighting anymore, but we couldn't take Cabal to the brig either. So I took the better part of the crew and we sailed away. Those who liked Pierre stayed with him. And then it dawned on you that the curse wasn't a joke. That same night, to be more exact, can you imagine how horrified we were? Yeah, I can't imagine. By the way, it wasn't only you who the curse affected. The people of Des Moines suffered from it, too. Dash it. You're lucky, Danielle, that Elizabeth recognized you when you came to her at night as a skeleton, and she started to look for the answer. Dear Elizabeth, yes, I should be proud of my sister. Well, Captain, since you've come to remove the curse, do it then. I guess I've already done it. All I had to do is deliver the jade skull of Micton Lelang Plug blah 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 as close to the captain of the Brig Queen as possible, so I did. The curse is gone? I'm not going to be a skeleton anymore, am I? I think you aren't. It's all over. How can I thank you for this, Captain? Well, you could. Oh, thank you, sister, though you know I have an offer for you. Join my crew as an officer. I happen to be a Corsair just like you are. I guess we'll be a great team. Well, the hell with it. Why not? I agree. Excellent. So now there's the Brig Queen. We'll set Nicholas Van Horn as the officer over. You can see that she was on there, but I want to take her on as a fighter. few encounters, just like I advised in the readme file. And this is, you still get this many encounters. So, that's why I tell you guys to set it to few encounters. East anyway, so let's take a course away from him. This will get us away from that other pirate too. Oh, transition screen. So. Some of you have heard me talk about the seams. We just crossed a seam. So that gets us out of the fight altogether. Boy, that's a pretty sky. This is why I play this game. Charleston. 
And this is where Daniel's sister Elizabeth is, who gave you the quest to go after the skull to begin with. Elizabeth's house. Oh, I forgot to put Daniel as an officer just a second. Tell me that close and dear friend of yours was your sister. Just in case. I see. You're your father's daughter, I can see. By the way, Daniel joined my crew as an officer. That's fine. I guess you'll be able to take care of her. She's totally lost her mind with all of this Corsair ship. Well, I'll try. And I guess that's it now. So, I thought maybe the developers would have had something where the two talk to each other if you do this. Uh, I guess not. I'm all ears, Captain. Alright, well, let's go look at her fight then. Now, keep in mind, when I first found her, because I wanted to do a substitute, one of our coders was complaining that the model was an old model and had googly eyes. I didn't realize it was one of the old Pirates of the Caribbean models, so I got rid of it. And I wanted to find something new. So I found this steampunk model. And, uh... thought, man, she'll do, but she's too bright. So she was all brightly colored. She looks like Cindy Lop or a punk, punk rock star or something. She had all these yellow and red stripes and stuff. So I toned her down and made her greenish and wore a dress and a different uh, corset that looked more piratey and um, she runs really good anyway I think she's turned out rather nice looking I like how she turned out. So let's go see if we can find some thugs so you can see her fight. Usually there's plenty of thugs to be had on these islands. But because I'm filming a video right now for you guys... Oh, here we go. Hello, thugs. Hey now! What is that I hear ringing? The way she shoots. I like the way she slings her hair back too. That's a fantastic animation. Very cool model. I didn't make the model, obviously. I just found it on a on Corsair's Harbor.
thugs are spawning. Come on, thugs, spawn for me. Oh, there was something there. A book. This island is pretty close to being thug-free. We have a thug-free environment. No robbers here to kill. Oh well, let's go. Hey, there's a thug. Stand and deliver. Watch her kill some skellies. Let's let the whole group in on this here. See her breathe hard there. Having the additional fighters from Jeffrey's additional fighter mod really makes short work out of a lot of these guys. I was hoping one of them would die so I could resurrect him using the skull. That's always fun. It's always fun to show in a video too. Let's see if I can get one of them to die. I know of no video online showing anybody resurrect with the skull. Killed Woods Rogers. Okay, now watch as I resurrect Woods Rogers with the Jade Skull. Woo! Sacrilege. It's only a video game. Showcased our nice little new Missy quite well now. This is Captain Daniel Shepard and the Gentleman of Fortune Eras 2 mod. Come and get it on Buccaneers Reef. She will be available in the Mega Patch coming very soon.